What's up everyone, it's Nerp here, and let's play some more Duelist. So it feels like every video now I'm going to get a tiny bit better. Um, I've changed my deck again. I lowered the amount of uh, units because I thought that my hand was always just filled with units that I didn't really have to play. So I added some more spells and artifacts and stuff, and I kind of changed my deck design. Uh, my last deck had a lot of huge, uh, huge creatures like these big golems. Um, like this guy, this guy, and then and this guy, and then I had to uh, draw the the three cost this thing, and got a lot of attack when I played this on high health creatures. So that wouldn't be most of my ranked matches so far, but that doesn't seem like a reliable strategy because it doesn't really have a great early game. So I made a different kind of deck. Um, in this game, since you draw two cards per turn, I don't think having a lot of big drops uh, is that helpful because then you're only playing one card in the late game when instead you could be playing two or three. So this is a more, I guess, more aggressive deck. And I got, I've opened a lot of packs. I spent all my gold, so I have cool cards like this guy. Um, he's, I just got him. Uh, I have some range units some more removal type stuff. So I'm still losing most of my uh, matches in ranked, but at least I'm, I have four ranked wins now. And let's try this again. And I heard there is gonna be a reset or something soon, like in two weeks, but I don't really mind that. Uh, I'm just, I wanna understand the game and get better at it. So I want a 2 drop to play, or a 3 drop, so I'm actually going to get rid of both of these. And I don't really get great stuff. I mean, this can go on my general. That's okay. I have something to play in the first turn, at least. Probably should have kept one of those 4 drops. Um, I'm going to get rid of the true strike. See if I can get a 2 drop. Well, that, that's fine. Because what that's going to allow me to do is play that next turn when I move my Silver Guard Squire into the Mana Springs. Because then I'll have four mana to play with next turn. Here I have another range unit. Uh, some people have been telling me range units are not that strong, so I might take them out of my deck. Uh, but from so far, range units have won me some games just because they can deal damage without taking damage back. Okay, awesome. So I'm going to just move here. I should probably sacrifice first. Uh, doesn't look like our general's gonna be in battle quite soon, so I'll get rid of this. Oh, this is a new card I got, Tempest. Deal 3 damage to all minions in general, so I guess that's a nice comeback spell, but... It does also hurt my side, I guess. So that might not be the best thing to do. Um... I'm going to play you back here and move you up up one. So you can't attack me with your general if you wanted to. I don't know, I'm trying to figure out the positioning of this game because it's a little different uh, to think about because each unit uh, by default can move two spaces. So it's hard to think about how you can play around things. I've been trying to look at some of the guides on the Duelist forums on how to move around and stuff. So this thing has haste or rush, but it doesn't look like a Killjoy is going to use it. So it's good to see other players see their decisions like, okay, the player uh, was okay with just, with playing a rush unit and not attacking it that turn. Um, so I do have this guy with range. You can hit anything, so I guess I could hit the general or I can hit you but I can actually kill you with this guy so I think that's what I'm gonna do um, I this is good this war surge I didn't think it was that good before but now it's a permanent 1-1 one, one. so I do like that and let's save some well, I could actually okay, I'll, yeah I'll actually do this I'll move forward too so I, so I can actually play another ranged creature So now I have two big range dudes. I'll move you down. I'll 
kill you, and I'll move you up. Because I think I'm getting a bit more of the flow down. I saw on the forums the positioning, it gets pretty complicated. There's like formations that are uh, more effective than others. I haven't figured that stuff out yet. When a rage general takes damage, restore this minion to full health. Okay, so that's pretty good. Um, I'll have to take care of that. Luckily, I have these guys. There's a nice big provoke guy. So, this is going to give me plus one one on both of these. And him, actually. So, let's see. Four attack and five attack is... I want to take this thing out. So, five attack. Uh, and I have five resources to work with. Let's go like, yeah, let's go like this. So I'm going to play this dude. He's pretty good. He's, uh, he could work as help for yourself getting more attack or he can lower health. So I'll lower this guy's health to five. Now I'll play War Surge. So he gets the buff also. Now he's at three, five. And I will use the 5 attack to take out you. And I guess it looks like we are uh, free to just attack this thing as we please. And he's just going to surrender. Alright, so I think uh, we did well that match. Alright, so the range units did help us there. So I guess... Uh, our opponent didn't think he was able to come back from that, so now I go down to rank 25. And that was really short, that was only 6 minutes or 7 minutes, so let's try to get another match. Um, same deck. It's been working decently well. And I just played against guys like uh, Blinky and a couple other of my friends. In the game and I've been losing most of those as well so it doesn't seem like I'm progressing that fast but at least I'm winning a ranked match here and there all right facing a magmar uh, go second um, what's this do I can destroy stuff. I'm gonna... I kind of want a 3 drop. But that might be risky to try to get. So I'm just going to... I'm just gonna hold the starting hand. Okay. That has ranged. I can destroy that with this this turn. So I'm probably just gonna do that. I don't want to take one ping of damage every turn. I'll move two up, and okay, actually destroy that with, no, that has two health, this has one health, so I'm just going to destroy that with this. And let's actually get rid of this right now. Okay. So next turn I could actually play this ranged creature instead range minion because I just have to, if I can walk over this thing, this uh, mana springs, then I'll have five to work with. And the, or I could play the second sun, which uh, is an 8-8 eight, eight when it's not dispelled. So I do like that. Unless he's going to take that mana springs. Alright, so he's going to take the mana springs it looks like. Not too good for me there, and I have to figure out how to take that thing out. Uh, let's get rid of, hmm, it's tough because I, if I reach this mana springs, then I could play both of these, but I'm getting... I'm gonna sacrifice this, see what I can find. Hmm. I think this is a good draw this turn. I'll play this. I'll kill us before it starts growing out of control. And 
And I'm gonna move closer to a Mana Springs. Alright. Yeah, it also protects me a little bit. So I think that was a good draw. Now, this coming turn, I will be able to... If I can walk over this Mana Springs, I can play the Second Sun. Um, if he plays a bunch of things down, I always have the Tempest to help out there. Alright, so he's gonna have five mana to work with now. That thing, I might have to destroy twice. And that's another one of those. Okay. I took out the thing that destroys ranged creatures out of the deck, I think. Hmm. So I'm considering... Moving up and killing this. Well, I do have five anyway, so I can play this no matter what. Or, should I play this? Three, and then I could play that. Yeah, he has two things. I have one thing. Let's just play this. My thing will go down in durability, though. And I'm going to toss this. Oh. Well... That could work. Yeah, I, th I think I like this. Um, you know, actually, let's play the provoke guy because I think I can hold off on playing um, the holy immolation. What this is going to allow me to do is just destroy a bunch of his uh, minions if they're next to each other. And I'm... This provoke guy uh, means... Oh boy. That is scary. Maybe I should have... Uh... And that gets bigger. And he's going to hurt me. Yeah, I probably should have... Probably should have done that other play last turn. Uh... Hmm. Let's... Get rid of the... I'm scared of this dude. I'm gonna have to take down the durability somehow, right? I think I'm going to retreat. And I'll get rid of the Sunstone Bracers. Okay, so I'm gonna go... Retreat. And I will, I can't get to you. I'll play this thing. You know what, let's damage. Now we'll do this. And now I'll play this. Okay, so you can actually destroy that with this guy, which isn't too good, but I guess if anything, it blocks a hit for on my general. Not sure if it's good to just play things if you know they're going to die in this game, but it seems like your hand replenishes fast enough that it's good to do that. So the general's big attack is gone. Maybe I shouldn't have retreated. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have oh, I Oh, the ranged creature attacks back. I didn't know that would happen. That's good for me. Okay. Okay, so you can walk right over the egg. Did not, you could, did not know you could do that. Okay, this thing's gonna get big fast. These grow creatures are pretty good, I think. That has frenzy. I could play that on my deck. I have that card. Maybe, maybe I'm underrating frenzy. I have another one of these. 
I think I'll play it. Oh, you still have Rebirth, so you're never gonna really die, I guess. Um, I can go with something 7. Uh, let's just do the same thing this time. I'm going to get rid of the Silver Guard Squire. Uh, so we'll play this. And now, I think I'll play this guy right now. I'm gonna move up because I know I can. This is he, his general's lower health, so I don't I, I don't feel bad just uh, trading two damage. Then I'll play. this thing and destroy you before you grow bigger but there's gonna be another little guy spawning from that did I sacrifice anything yeah I did I did replace already okay this seems like a closer match last match I got off to a great start and kind of just like demolished him with my range units this time it's a little bit back and forth but it seems like it was he was in his favor but that past two turns pushed it back towards the middle okay well he is able to just destroy this uh oh Oh god. How can I destroy this thing? Store 4 health in front of them and then deal 4 damage to nearby enemies. I think I'm going to need to get some, some provoke down. So I, I don't want to damage his general. I don't want his general to damage me either. Uh, probably I can play these big two big creatures here, so that's what I'll do. Um, I'm scared though. Let's move you back one. Play the second sun and the prov provoked guy there. So these guys are provoked. Okay. Not sure if I'm positioned well here, but at least I'm provoking two things and I have an 8 8. But provoking doesn't really do a whole lot because you can just destroy my provoked guy with his. Red Sinja. But at least that probably means this uh, second son is going to survive. And his general is only at 13 health, so maybe I can somehow win. So nearby enemies. If it says enemies instead of minions, I guess that just includes the general as well. So, if this were to attack the general and I could put 4 damage on it through the Holy Immolation, it would have 1 health. I don't have anything to deal 1 damage in my hand though, so it doesn't look like I'll win next turn. We'll see though. Oh no. That hurts. That's why this guy is not that good. 8 8 for 5, but Dispel is very real. going to deal damage to him. Okay. And a 2-2 Frenzy Praying Mantis. Um, let's see what we can find. I'll get rid of this War Surge. War Surge is interesting. I don't really have a place to hide a ranged unit right now. Uh, let's see. I think we're going to have to get this guy down. Okay, I'm going to kind of retreat. I'll destroy that. 
And then... Move you back. You back. Play you. I guess I'm protected when I'm back here with the ranged guy. And let's just... Yeah, let's just fill everything up. Maybe not a good idea to fill the board like this. Um, but I'm not sure... You might just be able to kill me really easily with like a... Thing that can damage a lot of creatures. But I'm not sure what other choice I had to do that turn. I do a War Surge. So... It's a lot of minions that would be affected by that for me. So we'll see what he has. At least, since his general's not in the action- oh no, the spell. Since his general's not in the action, at least this thing is not dealing that much damage. Okay. And then he's gonna destroy that, so he's just uh, wiping my guys out here. And is he gonna be able to destroy my ranged creature? I don't want him to destroy the ranged thing. Oh, uh, is that gonna be able to reach? Yes, it is. At least it destroys it back. And then a grim rock. Okay. So I have a zero eight. Uh, I think it's time to use this, the Holy Immolation. And I have a... Uh, this is... Alright, this is pretty good, I think. So, let's... Let's get rid of the War Surge. Maybe that's too good of a card to get rid of, I don't know. Okay, so I have... I could play a a three, a four, and a two. Not sure what the two is gonna do though. Okay, let's just move you here. Let's play this. So that's gonna kill them, and then I will. get you out of here and may as well put more pressure on him oh no wait skip all right uh yes yeah, so i'm not sure if i should have used this uh dispel guy just as a 2-2 creature to play. But, I don't know. Thought it was okay to do. Now I want my War Surge back because I have a bunch of little wimp minions now. <sighs> because Dispel seems like a pretty powerful, uh, powerful ability because you can just, or a powerful effect. Because a lot of uh, units have like their whole power tied into their ability, like this guy. Second slot. Okay, so I'll deal a little bit of damage there. And he's gonna try to come back with that red Sinja. And this thing has rebirth. Rebirth means I have to like destroy it twice almost. Or more, because the rebirth thing still has rebirth, I think. And he's almost running out of time. Okay, so now this is a 6-7. Uh, how can I do this? So this is going to be able to decrease the health by 2 or increase the attack by 2. Probably decreasing health by 2 is just better. Um, this is a provoke guy, and then I have deal 2 damage to a minion. Those are all cards that might be good this turn. Um, hmm. Let 
Let's... Let's replace this. Okay, this is good. Now I have a dispel thing. Let's... Let's dispel... This. Alright, so that's a five. Five health unit, and... I will... Play this. Decrease its health. Oh no, I can't. That's not good. I didn't realize I can't really do anything with that. Uh, I'll play this. Whoops, that was not good. I messed that up. Thought I can kill this guy, but I couldn't. I thought I can kill that as well. Alright, this is good. I can. It's almost like it has haste or rush. And this isn't even next to my general, so it doesn't have its three attack. And six attack there, that could uh, be almost enough to kill me. He has the right cards. Hmm. Oh boy. Do I lose? Eight and six. I know, I think he had the win there. Yeah, I think he just missed lethal then. Yeah, but he could have just attacked my general. Oh no, because he didn't miss lethal these. He had to destroy the provoke guy somehow. Okay, so that's not going to deal any damage back. That's destroyed, and I have a 10 health general here. Um, let's get rid of this. True strike. So in front of itself means I have to put it down right here, and it's going to destroy that. Okay. Let's uh let's retreat with our general. And I will play this. So that dies. And Don't want to put anything adjacent to that. Do I want to deal two damage or something? No, I don't see the point of doing that. Uh, do I want to... Hmm. Yeah, let's go like this and let's lower the durability on that. With our little guy. Okay, and I get these two things. Low drops, I want bigger things. Okay, now, I think it was pretty, I think this game would have been won by him earlier if I didn't uh, find that, that little thing that can flip some, some minions anywhere on the board. Because if this was near me, boy that wouldn't be too good. And it looks like this is about to get back into the battle, which is not good for me. Actually, he can move here and then get nearby damage on this guy. That would be bad. Or his general would have to take damage for that to happen. And if the general attacks the second son, the second son has no attack, so it wouldn't deal damage back to the general. So, I think uh, maybe he can't take advantage of this guy yet. So, still a close game. I can get rid of the last durability on, of his 8 attack general just with the 
Blood Tier Alchemist. That will deal one damage to the general, and I can get rid of that because durability lowers every time it takes a damage. Okay, he can actually kill that. I didn't even realize that, but he's gonna take four damage back. Which could be big. And he plays two of those. Okay, if I have a. Uh, actually, I'm really close to winning. If I just get a. Um, I just need one damage to win. I need to get one extra. Damage. I just need one of the uh, artifacts for this guy, or one of the. Uh... What else do I have? I'm not sure. Let's get rid of this. Uh, that's that works, right? I win because I can increase. I can't decrease the attack of the general because it only works on minions, but I can increase his attack. So let's play this here increase your attack and then I can kill him you don't have provoke right yeah no provoke wow I'm surprised I won that won that rank match I am proud of that win so we got two wins today or in this video and it seems like I'm getting better for you duelist pros out there please just give me tips uh, give me constructive criticism Tell me what I'm doing wrong uh, in the comments or anything really. And what do we get? A spirit orb. So we can get a pack with that. And I guess may as well. So we're down to. What does that mean? Oh, so now you have to win two wins to go down in rank. Okay. And I believe there's going to be a reset soon when uh, beta starts. So may as well just use all our gold and packs just to see the new cards. Yeah, I have no more gold really because I've got so many packs. Uh, oh, this is for Lionar. 4-4 four, four Celerity. Maybe that will go in. Another one of this. I already have a couple of those. So that'll be it for today. Like the video if you enjoy. Subscribe for more content. Follow on Twitch and Twitter. And I will see you next time.